What's up everybody? This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. So one of the biggest requests that I have on my YouTube channel is porting over uh, Google Camera apps to different devices. Now uh, on this YouTube channel, I've done the Google Camera app on the Galaxy Note 9 and the LG G6, but I never did it on the LG G7. So I have the LG G7 here and I ported it over the Google Camera app as you can see here on the device. Also, I have two Google Pixels here, two Google Pixel 3s. Uh, I got the Google Pixel uh, 3XL and the Google Pixel 3. So what I want to do in this video is I want to show you guys uh, how the Google Camera app works on the LG G7. Now, uh, kind of give you some disclaimers here. I will leave the link down in the description if you want to download this on your LG G7. Now, using the Google Pixel camera app on the LG G7 is going to be a lot slower when taking photos versus the regular Google Pixel. So just be advised of that. So in this video, I'm going to show you different aspects using the Google Pixel camera app and the regular stock app. Also, I'm going to do side by side comparison uh, between the Google Pixel 3 and the LG G7. So sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready. Woo, let's have some fun and follow me on this journey. Let's go. All right, y'all, so here it is. This is the stock camera app of the LG G7. And uh, I want y'all guys to see this here as I move along, go from side to side. And what I wanna do in this comparison video uh, between still footage and video footage to see if the Google camera app is better than the stock camera app on the LG G7. So there it is. Let y'all guys be the judge for yourself. And let me know about the audio on the stock camera app versus the Google camera app. So let me go ahead on the walk here. We got optical image stabilization. Now, one of my biggest pet peeves uh, of the LG devices, all the magic happened in manual mode. So this is all auto mode. And uh, so there it is. You be the judge for yourself. And looking at that. All right. Booyah. All right, so let me go ahead on the switch to the Google Camera app on the LG G7. All right, y'all, so this is the Google Camera app on the LG G7, and as I walk, now, I believe that the optical image stabilization may not be working on the Google Camera app, but you be the judge for yourself, because I'm looking at the viewfinder, and it is a little shaky, um, but the still footage and the video footage of the Google Camera app, you be the judge for yourself. We're looking at that. Let's go to this tree here. All right. And let me know how the audio is between the Google Camera app and the stock app uh, on the LG G7. Once again, this is the uh, Google Camera app on the LG G7. Boom, there it is. So let me go on the switch uh, to the Pixel here, got the Pixel and the LG G7, and let's see how good or how bad the camera app is on both devices. Check this out.
All right, guys, so this is the Google Pixel and the Google Pixel camera app on the LG G7 side by side. So I got the real Google Pixel and the LG G7 running the Google Pixel camera app. So let's look at that sky. All right, and you see the difference there between the LG G7 and the Google Pixel. Now, from my advantage point, look like the Google Pixel giving me a little more natural, but again, I'm using the Port It Over camera app on the LG G7, and let me walk. And again, I don't think the optical image stabilization is working on the Google Pixel camera app on the LG G7, so you may get a little more jumpiness versus the regular uh, app on the real Pixel. And uh, we're going to go audio from side to side. And you guys be the judge for yourself when it comes down to the audio on both of these devices. Which one looks better to you? Now, me looking at the viewfinder, the LG G7, bringing out that sky, giving it a little more bluer color. Let's look at the white balance on both of these cameras. There it is. Ooh. Look at that. Which one give you the better color there? Let's look at that plant. Wow. Is there a difference between both devices when you're looking at that plant? Boom. All right, so that is the real Google Pixel and the Pixel camera app side by side with the LG G7. All right, so this is the front-facing camera of the Google Pixel 3 and the LG G7 with the Google Pixel app aboard here. So you be the judge for yourself. Look at the background. Yes. So all you LG fans out there, and if you want to use the Google Pixel camera app on your LG G7, I will leave all the links down in the description below. Also, I'm going to go audio from side to side so y'all guys can hear which device has the best audio. Also, uh, using the Google Pixel camera app on the LG G7, you lose optical image stabilization, I believe. Uh, but uh, as you see, me transitioning into the light, uh, the Google, uh, the, the LG G7 is kind of a little flimsy a little bit uh, with looking at the background versus me. So this is the front-facing camera of the LG G7 using the Google Pixel camera app and the Google Pixel 3. Thank you. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave me comments down below. Let me know what you think about both of these cameras in action. See you guys on the next video. Peace.